so you are welcome to another episode of Winning Ways for Singles. I appreciate God for your life and I thank you for coming. Thank you for being part of this awesome program. In the last episode, um, I shared about knowing Jesus as the light of the world. Having Jesus in your life gives you direction, gives you purpose in life, gives you reasons to live, not just exist. So in this episode, we're going to be sharing on Jesus as the Creator. And I read from an anchor passage, which is um, John chapter 1, verse 1 to 5. Everything was created through Him. Nothing, not one thing, came into being without Him. What came into existence was life, and the life was light to live by. The light, light blazed out of darkness, and darkness couldn't put it out. I'm emphasizing on everything was created through Jesus. Nothing, not one thing came to be without him. So Jesus was with God at the beginning. He was with God as Trinity and they formed the heavens and the earth. So in Genesis, we were told that we have been given authority to live, authority to create. Because we were created in the likeness of God, we have been given the power to create. Do you hear what I just said? You have the power to create. Don't just think you are just existing. So now you have Jesus as the creator in you, you have power to create. So can you just imagine if God saw the voidness? The Bible says that the earth was without form and void. If God just saw the voidness and keep mute, what will happen? Nothing will come up. Nothing will happen. So to tell you, you have been created in the image, in the semblance of God. If you sit down there, you are not doing anything. You are just existing. You are not living. And before you know what is happening, you'll be old. You'll be gone. So at this active stage of yours, at this age of your single life, you are supposed to create. You are supposed to bring forth. Don't tell me this is how your parents have been doing. Forget about traditions. Please create. Don't tell me this is how it has been done in my, in, in my lineage. Please create because you have the power to create in you. God has given you power to create because you are created in the semblance of God. Please go ahead and create. I want to tell you that if you have Jesus in your life, if you appreciate the, the life of Jesus and is in you, you have that power to create. Please go ahead and create. We have examples of people in, in this world and you know they were comfortable at a time but at some point they realized they should do something more example is uh, the Wright brothers they were having their bicycle business going but they continued reading studying and researching till they were able to make a plane till today we see how the effect today we are still riding on, 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 on the result of what they did or if they sat down and they were comfortable with the bicycle that was in vogue that time, what will happen? That means our movement will be limited. Today, we can travel anywhere in the world. We can travel to anywhere in the world all because we have planes developed by these two brothers. So, Jesus could have stayed in the world, but he left you here as a single now. He left you here because you are the exact image of Christ. Someone created both. Someone created all things that we are using today. Don't stop at that level. You to go ahead and create something. Let the world feel your impact. The whole world is waiting for your manifestation. I pray as you go on to create, the Lord will prosper you in Jesus' name. Are you in need of any counseling? Or you are in need of prayers? Please call the numbers on your screen. You can also send a mail. Please subscribe to this channel to have notification on any other upload. God bless you in Jesus' name.